Okay, so by now you should have stopped using Internet Explorer as it's no longer been supported or updated and is insecure. So you might find though there's some web pages that haven't been updated yet to run in a more modern browser. Or there might be certain systems that are not designed to run in a more modern browser such as Google Chrome. Like for instance my security cameras, they're ActiveX based and of course you can't run ActiveX uh, in Google Chrome or any other browser apart from Internet Explorer. So this is a neat little guide which shows you how to install an add-on which tries to trick the website that you're loading into thinking that it's being run on a Internet Explorer based system. So first of all open up Google Chrome. Now like I say this add-on is only for Google Chrome. It may be available for other browsers later on but at the moment as far as I can tell it's only available for Google Chrome. So click in the address bar right at the very top of the screen and type Chrome Web Store. So that's Chrome space Web space Store. Then press enter or return on your keyboard. Then click here where it's got Chrome Web Store, Google Chrome. When the Web Store loads, then click into search the store and I want you to type in there IE space tab. That's IE space tab. Then press enter or return on your keyboard. Then you should see this icon here, IE tab. Just to the right of it, click on Add to Chrome. If you want to be sure it's the right one, it's the one that's offered by www.blackfishsoftware.com. So once you've confirmed that, just click Add to Chrome. OK, and then this box will appear, Add IE tab. Move your mouse over Add Extension and click that. And then you'll see this page load and it's a getting started guide on how to use the system on there. So have a read through that because that's quite handy. Next thing I do is I just click on this little icon here, the E icon just up here. And then it will tell us we need to do a once time installation of IE tab helper. So down in the bottom left hand corner of your screen you should have this IE tab helper. Just click on it once. If you get any warning messages come up on your screen then just accept them or say yes to installing IE tab helper. I didn't on here. And now this should mean if we do load a website that's compatible with Internet Explorer only, then um, hopefully it should pick it up. Or if not, we can just click on the E in the top right hand corner of the screen and it will put it into Internet Explorer mode. I'm just going to try going into my webcam. So I'm just going to block out the, the IP address that I'm typing in. OK, so my webcam's login screen started to load up. If I then click on the E just up here in the top right hand corner then I can see here this address bar appears and that means it's now put it into Internet Explorer mode. So it's emulating Internet Explorer. Um, if we want to go into the options to change any options for um, this IE tab right click on this E up there in the top right hand corner and then left click options and uh, in here are plenty of options for you to uh, to play around with on there. So you can put in there auto URL so if there's a specific website that you go to time and time again and you want it to automatically go into IE mode you can put the address in there and then click on add. Um, you've got exceptions so if you don't want a certain website to go into Internet Explorer mode you can put that in there and you've also got IE compatibility mode in here so you can force it to, uh, to to make it think it's Internet Explorer 7, 8, 9, 10 or 11. Now I would say probably best thing to try first of all is to try false standards mode in IE 11 to see if that, uh, that that helps and then work your way back up the list. So there we go, this shows you how to trick a website into thinking that you're running Internet Explorer in Google Chrome. Now it might not work in every instance but it's sure worth a try. Hope this guide helps, thanks for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at CWTech, that's at 
CW Tech on Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel. Just Google Chris Waite YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.